Okay, welcome back to the show, guys. Quick break, yes. And mm -hmm. now we're joined here by Chris from Barbados. And That's we right. have a special guest as well who's also in the building, Omar from the actual Anime Con Expo down in Barbados. That's right. Hey guys. Yep. What's, yeah, so let me let me let um, Chris uh, just introduce himself first and uh, then we'll get down to our second guest. Well, my name is Christopher Howell. I'm, I'm a Barbadian and basically I just, I like games, I like animes. Mm -hmm. I've always liked them since I was a kid from the time we had um, Vortex comics in Barbados. It was the first ah. two, two guys, two Trinidadian guys, they came down. They inspired us to, you know, the love of comics, the love of anime. They right. went out of business for a while and then some other guys took it up. And now they're like two two big, like, they're three big, big rival schools in, in, in Barbados. There's Vortex, mm. the guys came back, the uh -huh. original guys came back. And then there's the Zone, which accommodates, you know, the the rougher the rougher guys ah, right, and then right. you got have the anime spot which is more you know the kids oriented but they have good gamers as well between yeah. these wow. three that's good stuff you have so that yeah. it sounds like there's a great community over yeah, in community, Barbados community. um like we have um our gaming community and there's also an anime type yeah. community here as yeah. well yeah. so it seems like it's prospering a lot as it, as the years go by yeah. phenomenal phenomenal and and i we were really blown away i'm sure you guys are watching out there were blown away by the actual video footage of anime con from That's 2012 right. and we actually have the executive uh, director of anime con himself and we're talking about omar who's uh joining us via skype right That's now right. we're gonna switch over to omar hey what's up guys hey what's up what's happening omar so, uh, this is the face of, of one of the two faces, actually, of um, who, who conspired Anime Con. And um, we're huge, we're, we're, we've become really huge fans of that now, seeing what you guys have been doing. And exactly. we've been actually doing SourceCon, so it's actually great it's to, another to, convention yeah, to, as look, well. to look at that and see that that's happening in the Caribbean, and we're really proud to see what's going on. You know, uh, we're, we're actually really proud to see how um, Source, sorry, not SourceCon, but Anime Con has really gotten a lot of reviews can you tell us a little bit how how the community is and how anime is going on in Barbados right now oh, most definitely um, we were touching a market which has never been touched before so you know there's a great deal of trepidation we were a little nervous about entering this market but we did know that there was a group of people in Barbados who no one was paying any attention to you know they weren't necessarily the partiers they weren't necessarily the whoever but you know these guys were a bunch of cool ca cool cats who just wanted something to do nice. so um melissa young um and i were both the executive directors for the company we decided to put on um a pop culture convention where the persons who've been neglected by all the other types of entertainment can really get together and you know nerd out and geek out you know so yeah. persons who like your video games who like the comics who like the cosplay who like the draw who like to write who like to do whatever you can all just come and like their anime and That's just right. come together in one place and just enjoy themselves so uh, ani so, uh yeah anime con is is it a one day event is it a two day event tell us some more about that and the, the volume of activity which goes on yeah it was it was um, a one day event the first time we had it in 2010 and then upgraded to um two days in 2011 2012 and 2013 it'll be two days again uh, we're looking to put it into three days but not just yet we're just we're working to get there first um over right. the weekend you know we get a packed house you know everyone's really really happy you know it's, it's all about everywhere around you know there are awesome gaming competitions or awesome art competitions cosplay competitions and it's just all love all around yeah man that sounds pretty good so we realize that um the community of course is growing really rapidly and we love to have we love to see the the costumes that you know they had you were telling us earlier that some of them had actually made their own costumes yeah definitely we have a cosplay competition and of course you know when you have a competition you have to reward persons for their efforts but you know we're not rewarding the richest person there we're rewarding the person who has the most talents we don't encourage persons to go and buy a costume to cosplay you tell right. persons, you know, you go, you get your cloth, you get your needle, you get your soldering gun, you get your whatever. 
and you make your own costumes and reward you for it. Um, and you very successful. In the video, I, I, you guys should have seen, uh, I was walking around with Cloud Stripes Buster Sword. Oh yeah, we, we couldn't miss that. <laughs> speed long. And when you, you can break it apart into different um, different swords that Cloud carries. So you, you can pull apart the one big sword wow. into three separate swords. So these are different things mm. that, you know, you, this is the level of talent that we have right here in the Caribbean, and people need to know about it. That's so I, I also noticed that there were many groups who were actually part of the um, video and I think one yeah. of the, the groups in particular was called Magic the, the Gathering. Magic the, yeah, Gathering. Magic the Gathering. Are you familiar with Magic the Gathering up there, Chris? Yeah, we, we, I'm very familiar with the, with the group Magic the Gathering. Um, at this point, just let me big up David Bayer and Jared. Jared Holder, you're doing a good job. <laughs> Mikey Smith, keep it, keep it cool, keep it cool. That's you know right. what I mean? Magic the Gathering is what you call your, your cosplay, you know, your, your card play game. Yeah. It's more like ah. a chess base. Kind of like a Yu-Gi-Oh! It's, it's, it's a strategy, strategy based game. card game. Strategy game. And yes. uh, the, what's great and what I realize at Anime Con is that they combine all of these, uh, the youth, the, the pop culture, and right. modern media and brought it, they've brought it all in one place, one venue, uh, the skateboarding, uh, the actual theatrical the, arts. Theatrics, of, oh, that, that is wonderful. over the top. And That's we have to give you big props over there, uh, Omar, for what you've really, We're that. really proud of that, man. That is a great step in the right direction. And I can tell you one thing, you could look forward to seeing Gamer Vibe next year at Anime Con in Barbados 2013. Look, you know, we're going to be traveling the globe, man. <laughs> oh, I come into, I come into. <laughs> <laughs> Anime Con is just not all fun entertainment. There's a learning aspect to it as well. You know, there are guys in, in Barbados, and I'm sure over there where you are as well, who actually develop their own video games, you know, and, you know, persons yeah. who want to draw their own comics. Like last yeah. year, for example, we had DC Comics come down to, to Barbados. Wow. And those yeah. of you who don't know who DC is, they're the guys who own Superman properties, the Batman properties, Green Lantern, whatever have you. Well, it and looks like there's Barbados, a lot of opportunities. And Wow. guys are doing and they're like you know this is fantastic you guys are actually drawing and, and painting and, and inking and writing at a national level That's so incredible. when you can see the people who have been who are idols who are mentors who are whatever come and give you some actual positive feedback some constructive criticism encourages you to push to the next level one guy from dc actually told um, a gentleman from barbados to apply to dc to get a job immediately because it's wow wow so good. that's that's great, no, that's what, great. what's happening you're giving people opportunities and that is exactly what we want people to see and recognize and mm -hmm. respect and appreciate right. uh, here on game of vibe 2.0 that's right gaming yeah. anime culture everything cosplay this is where it's going this is where it's at it doesn't this get new better era. it doesn't get better than this or does it Probably. You guys have to stay tuned to find out. Mm -hmm. We're all out of time here That's on this right. segment. Any last uh, words, final closing um, comments, guys? Man, we will see each other. Try and save me from these guys that beating my tail in these video games. Try and come here so yeah. we can share some links with them. Bring it, bring it, bring it. We're yeah. going right. to see we you guys in the lobby. We're going to see you guys. <laughs> <laughs> all right, any last words, Omar, before we take off? Well, I was just going to say that, you know, um, come through to Anime Con next year. You will not be sorry that you did not Listen, I are very eager to meet all of you. Come through, bring your friends, bring your family. We can show you how, you know, you can do something in the Caribbean, which is completely different, and really enjoy yourselves. And learn a bit as well. That's great. All right, all I right, expect guys. my inventory in the mail tomorrow for that flight to Barbados. So let's mm -hmm. check that out. The rest of you guys, you must join as well. It's, it's something you it's cannot good. miss. So it's on incredible. that note, we're out of yeah. time, guys. So stay tuned for more Game of Vibe. We will be back. Chris, more to come. good having you on the yeah, show, man. Thanks for having you, bro. Take it easy. All right, cheers. Yeah, man, thanks. Respect. Take it easy. All right. Omar, we're out of here. Yep. All right. Don't go anywhere. There's more Game of Vibe coming right up. <laughs>